Hey everybody, it's Brett with Summit Auto Reviews and today I'm going to be installing this Oedro Hard Trifold Tonneau Cover on this 2021 Ford F-150. This tonneau cover is going to fit your 2015 to 2024 Ford F-150 with the five and a half foot short box. I'm going to be unboxing it. We're going to be installing it, showing you how easy it is, as well as going over the benefits of having a tonneau cover. Now, if you like the tonneau cover and how it works in this video and how it looks, uh, you can get it one in the affiliates link to Amazon in the description below. Get a little bit of a cut on that. Really appreciate it if you buy one, but let's get right to it. Get this out of the box and get to installing it. I'm sure it won't take that long. All right, so I already have all the things cut, all the tape is cut, and I figured I'd put it in the back of the truck so that I could get it out easily without dropping it or anything. And uh, it folds up just like so. You get all your clamps that have to go on to the tonneau cover right here, and they're nicely packaged in this foam and has uh, wrapping around them. And then there's this piece right here. We'll find out what these all do. And uh, comes wrapped nicely in the bubble wrap here. So we'll get all that off. You can probably fast forward on this. You can see it's a really nice heavy duty tonneau cover. And probably a two person job to get it out of the box. I just don't want to damage it because it is such a nice tonneau cover. Now that we got it out of the box, we can get the box out of the way. All right, so you can see that this is how it looks when it comes out of there. You're gonna wanna probably undo all the tape and the straps. And then you're gonna to wanna to figure out which end goes to the back of the truck, and which end is at the front of the truck so that you can install it properly, which I'm gonna do right now. And then I'll show you how I did it. All right, before we start anything, I recommend that you open up your entire tonneau cover uh, before putting any parts on it because when you completely open it up, Number one, you wanna to check to make sure that there's no damage to the tonneau cover before you install it. Last thing you wanna do is spend all this time installing it, realize it's damaged and have to take it all apart. But the other thing that you're gonna get when you open it up and make sure it's not damaged is you're gonna find not only the instruction manual, but you're gonna find the foam piece that goes at the top of the bed. There's also a light in here that uh, you can attach anywhere. If your truck doesn't have LED bed lighting like this one does, you can attach this light in here to make it brighter inside. So that's the first thing, open this up, check it for damage, make sure there's nothing damaged on it. And then number two, you can get your instruction manual and your foam piece here. And I'll show you how this foam piece goes on first. Cause that okay, so the first thing you're gonna wanna do is grab all your parts here. And a, a lot of this stuff is just spare parts. Like these pieces right here are spare parts for uh, your sliders on these things. In case they break, you get two of those. You also get a spare snap, like so. And then you get a spare uh, piece right here for putting those snaps in in case one of those breaks. So the first thing you're gonna wanna grab, and this goes on the piece closest to the cab are these two wing nuts and then the metal clamp downs. That's the first thing you're gonna to wanna to do. And you're gonna be putting these clamps so that they are gonna be securing underneath the bed rail. So you just put those on like so, and then you can put your wing nut on And then we'll be putting it on there and then we can tighten it down once we get it placed. I'll put the other one on and we'll get it going right away. So I'm not gonna be actually installing this on this truck. 
uh, because this is not where the tonneau cover is gonna stay. Uh, but you just wanna take this uh, adhesive off. Make sure this area is clean. So you wanna get a wet rag, wipe this off, make sure it's clean. And then you're gonna wanna take the adhesive piece off and you're gonna wanna just make sure that it lines up evenly. Go from bed rail to bed rail and then you're gonna wanna cut it with a razor or a scissors or something and then just stick it down and make sure that it's nice and sealed and that it's not gonna go anywhere and then you can get to putting your tonneau cover on. For this demonstration, I'm not gonna actually install this, uh, so, but that's the first step. On to the next. Okay, so remember, the clamp's gotta go, basically the clamp side faces the top of the tonneau cover Put that on there, get your wing nut, just kind of loosely put it on there like so. And then we're gonna put the tonneau cover and place it onto the front of the truck here. Keep in mind these are, this is a fairly heavy tonneau cover. The whole thing is pretty heavy. And we're gonna put it on here. You wanna make sure that it's even on both sides before you put it down. You're gonna to wanna to line it up with your seal that you put on. So the other thing when you're getting this, let me lower the camera here. These seals right here, just line those up with the bed rails so that it's even on both sides. And then what you're gonna to wanna to do before we tighten this down is we're going to want to close the entire tonneau cover and make sure that it's fitted properly lengthwise and then we'll clamp everything down and we'll be all set to go. All right once you get under here this is pretty easy. All you have to do is make sure your clamp is underneath your bed rail. Now there's instructions in case you have a drop-in bed liner. You're gonna have to cut some holes, but just turn your wing nut up until it's nice and tight. And that should be nice and secure. And then you're gonna to wanna to do the other side. Once again, just put it up there. Just make sure it's nice and snug. And that's as easy as that. Now we can put our other clamps on and be all set to go. So you're just gonna to wanna to grab one of your clamps out of the parts foam and you're gonna to wanna to get the clamp through the screw here, and then there's a nut. I don't know if you can see it, but there's a hole right there. And we'll get it on there, and you're gonna to wanna to get it into that nut, and then just turn it on, like so. And that's what it should look like when uh, you have it on there and then that can tighten it down for you. These are safety clips, so once you get it in place, you're gonna to wanna to put that clip in there so stuff in the back doesn't knock it open. Make your tonic cover go flying on the highway. Once again, you're just gonna to wanna to get that bolt through the hole like that, get it right into the nut and turn it on. All right, now we can close the next section of the tonneau cover and bolt those down. So now that we have these all set to go, you're just gonna wanna turn it until it's up underneath the lip of the bed rail. So I'm gonna have to tighten it just a little bit more. It's kind of a trial and error. So when you get it under there and you push it down like that, that's what tightens it, so we're close. All right, 
So it should be nice and snug. You want to make sure that that's not going to go anywhere. And then you can put your safety pin in so that it doesn't open up accidentally. What that does is it just protects it, prevents it from opening up in case luggage back here hits it. So those clips are a little harder to get in because it's hard to see. So there you go. So now the clip's in and now it won't release on accident. And now the same thing for the driver's side. I'm just gonna wanna turn this until it's close. You know, that's probably too tight. You don't want to make it too tight either, otherwise you might break that plastic piece there. There you go. Now put your safety pin in, and we're set for the final piece. So now that we have our clamps on our last piece right here, just gonna to want to put it down. Once again, make sure your fitment's all nice and snug here. Looks pretty nice and even everywhere. Just gonna to wanna to grab that clamp, turn it. Getting, get it up enough so it stays nice and tight. All right, now it's nice and secure. We'll do the other side and uh, we'll do some final shots with the tonneau cover on so you can see how nice it looks and we'll be all set to go. Basically want to just turn it all the way up to the threads. I think that's a pretty good start. All right, now it's all secure. Once again, verify. Oh, and you can put your sticky on. So you take that out, it's got an adhesive on it. Just peel it and put it wherever you need a light. And then it's a press button. Uh, you're gonna need batteries with that. But let's close its tailgate. And shuts nice and solidly. It's right even and flush with that tonneau cover. And you can see just how nice that looks. Really a good looking fold up tonneau cover. Yeah, I think it looks really good. Get a side view here. So there you go. So I hope the video was helpful to you to get your Oledro hard fold tonneau cover put on your F-150. And uh, if it was, give me a like, subscribe, and share on the YouTube channel. I really appreciate it. And if you wanna get one of these tonneau covers in the link below is a link to my Amazon affiliates page. You can get this very tonneau cover off of there. And uh, really a nice tonneau cover. It's got a nice texture to it. Looks really clean. And I think for the price that you'd pay for some of the other um, brands out there. This Oedro piece is a really, really nice tonneau cover. Thank you so much for checking out the video. Remember to like, subscribe, and share. And until our next product review and installation, have a great day.